Hi friends, it's Angie playing Moons of Madness and we are stepping into this. We are using this this injector to inject Ugh! What the hell? <gasps> oh no. God damn it. Lucas. Declan. Lucas is dead. Lucas is fucking dead. Oh god. Oh no. shit, He's yes. Completely covered in that black fluid. It's everywhere. Pulsing. It's it's on the walls, on the floor. It's it's like it knew. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Breathe. Shane, you're not gonna die. Nobody else is gonna die. Nobody we else. Just <laughs> have to keep going. I feel like I'm gonna be sick. I can't deal with this. Yeah. Jesus. Jesus, I'm so sorry, man. Oh, I'm gonna have nightmares tonight. Uh, oh my god. You know what? I I feel a bit sick myself. Lucas, the mission control wants you to crunch some numbers on a potential future visit to the two moons. Think over the logistics and of both an Earth launch and Mars launch mission. Work some rough calculations for both scenarios. Make this a priority. Also have a look at the moon orbits. Phobos should be 1.4 Martian diameters. Out with a 7.66 hour orbit. And Deimos at 3.5 diameters and 30.35 hours. But mission control say, says they showed up as significantly closer and faster. It might be a glitch. I'll leave you to it. Josie. Oh, I'm not feeling too well. Have this note been here before? This was for sure. Okay, I'm not reading that. But there were some creatures here. And I'm concerned <laughs> that they just ran off into this. Oh wait, there's like a vent or something, but I don't think they, they would have fit there. Uh, <clears throat> okay, all right, I can't go there. Oh, maybe I can, but there is a flower, so I can't get near to that door or to this. Read. <laughs> it did notice me. Uh, supplemental lo log regarding an ongoing survey um, of samples in the search of evidence of microbial life on the planet Mars. Have I read this already? I think I might have. I think I might have read this when I he when I was here the last time. Okay. And back away, back away. Okay. And what's in here? I am pretty sure that I read already all of the documents here. That was just a security protocol. There's like a rock? Hmm. Hmm. I can look at it a bit, but not much. Also, yeah. Jesus, I'm going to be sick in my stomach. This is not working. At least we have some tomatoes. <laughs> uh, the computer is working. Username Van Buren. Lucas. Something terrible has happened to Ina. She calls out to me. I can hear her taunting, her voice echoing through the halls. I know I can convince her. I have to. Chemical vial... Vali 9928B. I'll need the improved counter agent. Dr. Volkova, one of the hybrid samples. Mauna Loa hybrid? I clipped from the news specimens is especially dangerous when it blooms it expels a noxious cloud initially i assumed these were spores spores of some kind but aside from a mu mu mucusy residue with the chemical composition of saliva the cloud dissipates quickly analysis of the gas shows high levels of tetradoc do toxin 
From the small clippings I took, the neurotoxin is not strong enough to cause more than nausea and discomfort, but from a full-grown plant up close, the effects could be fatal. He coded a bio-gauge script. Lucas and Ina both knew this could happen. Dr. Volkova, to follow up, I've attached a simple bio-gauge script designed to combat exposure to the poison released by the hybrid bloom. Please download for your safety. The bloom reflex is triggered when an organism comes into close proximity. Alternatively, a pulse of high frequency could also trigger the reflex prematurely, allowing the gas to dissipate be before approaching. For the time being, I took the initiative to pull these plants from the hypodronics wheel so we can talk. Software updated, not Orochi certified, but if Lucas was correct, a quick scan with the bio gauge should trigger the plant's bloom with a high frequency pulse. Aha, uh -huh, so it can bloom and it can give me time to walk past it. Oh, okay. <clears throat> and here we have another vial. A final gift. I hope it was worth it. Craft stronger thi thing. Okay, this is the script. I wonder if... Th no, it's not the script. Okay. I wanted to say, I wonder if it's the same. Or maybe if we have now, like... Visions and hallucinations and it's not... And these things, although we saw that before, are not the same right now. That's amazing. Now I can find a way into the greenhouse. Oh, Thank cool. you, Dr. Van Buren. I should head back to the infirmary and synthesize Thanks, the stronger Lucas. poison. Thanks, Lucas. Um. Ah! <laughs> okay. Okay. Create poison. Did I have only one? The the thing that I created I'll was need it. need to use the centrifuge again. Was this the like the only uh, the only the one you use only? And this was green before. What changed? Oh wait, have I read this before? Yes, I did. Okay. Okay, I read it. Uh, do I need any more vials? Or can I use the ones that are already here? Are they empty? Okay, I need to take... I need to blah, 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 um, make a new a new pattern. Okay. All right. All right. Let's start with the new pattern. Oh, I have. I was about to say, oh, I have a lot of those now, but no, they are just circling around. I will probably need this and I will need I will need um, not this one probably this one and and which one Probably this... No. But you know what? Let's take this one. And let's pull out... Which one? This one. Yes. And put... This. Yes. Okay. And they are equal, so it should work. Ugh. <sighs> Right. Okay. We have a better thingy. Declan, I have what I need. I'm going into the greenhouse, though I'm not sure what to do from there. Uh, dump the poison in the water reclaimer. The reclaimer would. No, you're on the right track. I need to hit it at the source. If I can get to the water filtration system, inject it there, the whole system is poisoned. It could work. Before they close again. Uh, but wasn't there like a monster in the green room? Like, seriously, a monster? 
Can I go in here? No, I can't. Okay. Okay, then we are going to place the monster. Declan, this is out of control. Even if I could use the poison, the greenhouse door is covered in roots. It, it's walled off. Okay, try the emergency airlock by the greenhouse. Ah, uh, only way out now is the airlock in front of the greenhouse. Yeah. Okay, is this like the... It's just a short EVA to the airlock at the back of the greenhouse. Declan, there's no helmet in this airlock. <gasps> and the only way to the greenhouse is from the outside. Okay, what about the other airlocks? They're completely overgrown. Two seconds, door opening. Approximately 50 meters. Another two seconds, atmosphere. <gasps> Ten seconds. I need oh, to do shit. it. shit, I know what you're thinking, but I can't... Your earplugs will prevent your drums from rupturing. Exhale completely. You'll have to sprint. It's only minus 19 Celsius and no risk of frostbite. It's theoretically possible. This yeah, it is. It's the worst idea ever. Yeah, but I need to know where I'm going and I don't know. I don't know. <coughs> oh. oh, am I going that way? I think I'm going that way. Oh, shit. Oh, I hope this is the right way, otherwise, I'm dead. <laughs> Oh my god. Minus 19. It's not that bad. But the worst is like no oxygen. <laughs> Cross the surface of Mars. Ah, please. Please, button. Ah. <laughs> yes, thank you. Oh my god. Oh, great. Oh, fantastic. Oh. Jane, come on, come on, check in. I'm here. Uh, I'm freezing. Headache is back. My ears are ringing. I should be dead. Jesus, slow down. Fuck, catch your breath, please. Are you good? Tell me you're good. Can you walk at least? I'm still standing. Hoping I'm not going into shock. Uh, I lost 40 years in 10 seconds. Uh -huh. okay, we'll, we'll get you looked at as soon as we can. Hang in there. Oh man, the poison tree. I have to say that having Declan in my ear is so comforting. I'm so grateful. Friend, you are just the best. Um, scan. Connect. Um, okay, I don't know if I'll be doing anything with you guys. I probably need to go oh I didn't even know you were there <laughs> those flowers I mean Van Buren anything new uh, no uh, no okay these are old messages so nothing new in here I guess that would be logical considering that um, uh, uh, What's his name? Van Buren. Uh, Lucas tried to get to the laboratory, but he died. It's gotten worse, Declan. Way worse. I'm going to the water purifiers. I hope it'll be enough. Okay, well, after what you just did, you better fucking kill that thing. I mean, after what we just did, it would be best if it was already dead and I didn't have to do anything with it. Oh, what? I'm, oh, is this the helmet? Or is it something else? Or is it like some kind of a, a fruit? Okay. Uh-huh, nothing of interest. So let's proceed up, I guess. Okay, not this dip. Stab. Oh, stabity stab. These guys are gone. Do I... Can I walk over? I mean, it's a stump. Wait, but it's... 
It's disgusting, okay. I should be able to just walk over it. Like, seriously. Do I need to go down? No, I need to go up, right? Checkpoint reached. I'm concerned. I was angry with my friend. I told my wrath, my wrath did end. I was angry with my foe. I told it no. I told it not. My wrath did grow. And I. What? Wa waited? Watered? I'm not sure. And I. Watered in it fierce. Night and morning with my tears. And I. Sup suppered sup I don't know sup suppered it with smiles and with soft deceitful vials and it grew grew both day and night till it bare and Apple, apple, bright, and my foe beheld its shine, and he knew it was mine, and into my garden stole when the night had veiled the pole. In the morning, glad I see my foe out stretched beneath the tree okay this was very hard to read but I managed I should get an achievement for that okay so basically this is not the way we need to go down that's fine that's fine it's fine it's fine it's fine everything's fine I hear some growling but it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Shane, there's a body here. Jesus. The impact site is a smoldering mess, and we don't really have the time or the equipment to search through all this. Are you alright? Yeah. Mars sucks. Mm. Wait, before I go there, let's check out this place some more. Okay, obviously I can't go there. Let's try not to squeeze in. What's this? So, I need to go down. Catch will get me where I need to go. Uh-huh. If you think so. It's surprisingly clean in here. Considering how the rest of the place looks like. <gasps> Wait. Wasn't there water here last time? And I think Ugh. Um Am I going the right way? There are two filtration tanks down here. Gotta inject them both. We'll see if it works. Okay. <laughs> Water tank one done. Uh, something is gonna chase me down here soon. Something definitely is going to attack me because it hasn't for some time now. There's number two. But what if it isn't a poison? What if it's like the opposite? Declan, it really didn't like that. The poison is already polluting the water supply. Oh, that's a win. Now uh -huh. get up to the environmental control console and dump the entire reservoir on that bastard. Uh-huh. Uh, Shane, we found something. Josie saw a door along the escarpment near the crash site. She wants to check it out. A door? 
carved out of the cliff. It's massive. I told her we need to recon with you, but she's fixated on this. Orochi has secrets upon secrets. It, it is Orochi, right? Uh -huh. Apparently, we're going to find out. You know what? We're going to find out next time. <laughs> Because I'm just dying here and I know that if I just stuck my head outside it's something is gonna try to eat me so uh, before that happens I will take a break I will go and drink some tea breathe in and out deeply with relief that it's not real <laughs> but right now thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll see you next time bye Thank you.